If you have a Microsoft keyboard like this, <clears throat> the model is keyboard 600. It's around 2018 model. This particular one is, but I think they still make it and you can still buy it. If you notice when you're typing rather quickly that the space bar squeaks, every time you hit it, it'll be a little beep, 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 slight squeak. Let me show you how to resolve it. Uh, no tools are needed. You just have to carefully but firmly push down on these keys here so that you can grab the space bar and just quickly pull it up and off. Okay, so you get to it right there. It's gonna be kind of attached, sorta of, kinda, of, but it's not permanently attached. So just get underneath it and pull it straight off like this. Be careful. Now if you damage you know, a couple of these tabs, whatever, not that big a deal, you can still put it back on. The issue though is these plastic little posts are squeaking inside their little chambers as well as this little yellow or this little aluminum rod or whatever it is right here is moving and squeaking sort of kinda. <clears throat> so if you can get some sort of uh, maybe a light lithium lithium grease spray, something that's not petroleum based, <clears throat> if you can help it, you know, just something, even a light oil, you know, very something very liquid and light. And just put a little bit on these areas wherever the space bar contacts it. Okay, so you can put just a little dab of you know, very light liquid oil. Okay, and then see how it uh, pops in place. That little, little rod will pop in. I know it's not focusing too well. The little rod will pop in on both ends here and here. So that's how it has to be put back in. Okay, and then you just line up everything like you see it there. Get it lined up and firmly push down like so. And there it will be. Oh, you may want to clean it out too. When you pull that off, you'll see all kinds of debris if your keyboard is older. If you had it for a long time, you may want to get your shop vac and vacuum it out or maybe your compressed air and blow it all out in there. But yeah, this area needs cleaning and that should get rid of it. I actually bought a <clears throat> another one because my keyboard is old and worn out. I've had it forever. So I went in and got a new one and it's not very expensive. And this one even slightly squeaked also, a brand new one. So that's why you want to be careful uh, not to spray petroleum-based liquid because notice it will discolor the plastic. So be very careful when you're doing all that. But yeah, I did the same for this one. Now no more squeaky. And I just thought some of you guys might be interested and this could be for any different computer keyboard. So, um, so yeah, just keep your eye out for squeaks on your keyboard and you can hopefully fix it. And check out our channel. We've got all kinds of other things, fixes, and how-tos relating to cars, computers, eBay, Amazon, YouTube even, dirt bikes, ATVs, Harley-Davidson's, uh, Cadillac ATS-V, Ford Mustang, GT, older Chevy trucks, Yamaha motocross bikes, just all kinds of stuff. So surf our channel. You might find some cool things in there that you might need in the future. So like, subscribe, follow. We have we have a join button also if you want to contribute to the channel. We really appreciate any help you can give us. My name is Biker Dave, signing off here. Y'all have a great day.